Visual processing begins in the retina, the receptive surface inside the back of the eye. Light enters the eye, passes through the layers of cells in the retina, and strikes the photoreceptors located in the back of the retina. Light activates the photoreceptors, which modulate the activity of bipolar cells. These cells, in turn, connect with ganglion cells located at the front of the retina. The axons of the ganglion cells form the optic nerve, which carries information to the brain. Two other types of neurons, horizontal cells and amacrine cells, are primarily responsible for lateral interactions within the retina. The bipolar cells and ganglion cells are organized in such a way that each cell responds to a small circular patch of the retina, which defines the cell's receptive field. The receptive fields of retinal ganglion cells are concentric, consisting of a roughly circular central area and a surrounding ring. Retinal ganglion cells have two basic types of receptive fields, on-center, off-surround, and off-center, on-surround. The center and its surround are always antagonistic and tend to cancel each other's activity. First, let's look at the response of an on-center ganglion cell to a spot of light. When no light is falling on the receptive field, a spontaneous level of activity is recorded from the ganglion cell. To see what happens when a spot of light enters the receptive field, use the mouse to position the beam of light so that it falls on either the center or surround of the receptive field. Notice that when the light enters the surround region of this on-center ganglion cell, the level of activity recorded in the cell decreases. Conversely, a spot of light in the center of the receptive field increases the firing rate. A maximal response in an on-center ganglion cell is achieved when the entire center of the receptive field is illuminated. Likewise, if we illuminate only the surround using a ring of light, the ganglion cell is maximally inhibited. Note that if we illuminate both the center and surround region, the response is just above baseline. Center effects are slightly stronger than surround. 